Man, I have been waiting for this box for a very long time. And it's finally here, so let's get into it. What's up guys, BJ Kicks here. I buy comics, I read them, and I review them. All for your viewing pleasure. If you're new here, welcome. And if not, welcome back. Uh, now on this channel, I talk about comics. So you find unboxing videos, haul videos, comic book reviews, all sorts of stuff. So if you're interested in comic book content, hit the subscribe button. As I film this, we just hit 4,000 subscribers. And that is amazing because I don't know there's only been like a handful of times where I've been in the room with 4,000 people and each of those times were concerts for artists not named me. So that's awesome. I really appreciate every single one of you who watches these videos, who hits the like button, who comments and engages in the community, who's joined the K-Squad and all that. It's been an amazing year on YouTube and I'm excited to see how 2022 goes. Uh, but speaking of amazing years, Earlier this year, I told you guys about a book that I was backing on Kickstarter that I was just kind of blown away by, and it kind of coincided with Black History Month, and it was just great, right? Well, that time, that time has come. My Kickstarter has arrived. You read the description of the video, so you already know what's going on. Now, before I jump into this, I got to give a quick shout out to our channel sponsor, Organic Price Books. They are the best place to look for collected editions, omnibus, oversized hardcovers, trade paperbacks, all of those. You get them for amazing prices with incredibly fast shipping and, and, and the best customer service in the game. So definitely check out Organic Price Books if you're looking to buy collected editions. And when you do, use my coupon code BJKicks at checkout. You'll save an extra $2 on every order, every time, and it does go a very long way toward helping the channel. So I appreciate that. But now let's get into this box. Now it's actually, it's open already because I thought this was something from my day job. I didn't know this was coming today. I didn't, they didn't send me any kind of tracking or anything. So I didn't know. But um, when I saw what this was, I was like, oh snap, let me just close this back up and I'll show it to the YouTube, the internets, you know? So let's go ahead and get this open. Um, boom. So this is a title that um, I was really excited about. I didn't know much about it when it first came out. I kind of learned about it from the Kickstarter. So I'm gonna go ahead and take everything out of this box, um, which was packed very well, by the way, I must say. It's always scary, like when people send you comic books in the mail, cause you don't know. Sometimes it'll be good, sometimes it won't. Who knows, right? So. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I am excited. I'm so excited that I just can't hide it. All right. So we're going to go one by one from these, from, for this stuff, right? So the first thing we got here is this. This is excellence. Book number one, the limited edition Kickstarter only version. This is the deluxe hardcover. This book is awesome. This book is so awesome. Um, and I am incredibly, incredibly excited about it. Uh, so Excellence is a book by Brandon Thomas with art by Kari Randolph, colors by Emilio Lopez. This book is just, it's dope. It's super dope. Um, it's dope. Man, look at this. It's got red gilded pages. It's got a gold ribbon. This book is beautiful. Um, so anyway, I'll show you what else is in this package and then I'm gonna go ahead and uh, I guess we'll do an overview. We might as well, right? So this book, like I said, it's um, it follows this kid, Spencer, um, as he's learning the ranks of magic um, in the family that he's born into. He's got some issues with his dad He's uncovering the issues he has with his dad, as well as the issues with the overall structure of the society he's been born into. And it's awesome. Now, I backed this book at the agitator level, I think is what it was called. So basically, I wanted to make sure that my book was signed and 
all sorts of stuff. So I believe it's supposed to come with a signed book plate, although I don't see that in here. We'll, we'll see. We'll see what happened. We'll see what we got. So first up, I got this little cardboard sleeve here. So I'm going to go ahead and open this up. Ooh, very cool. So what's inside the cardboard sleeve are these two. I think they're called G Clay. G Clay prints. So this one obviously inspired by the movie Juice. We got Spencer. We got his brother. This is dope. Super dope. Um, and it's signed by Kari Randolph from the year 2019. This was a variant cover for the series, if I'm not mistaken. And then we got this other one here, also by Kari. This is dope. This is exciting. All right, so we got these two prints. Those are good, cool in their own right. These are six inches by eight inches, if I'm not mistaken. Um, we've got this. I'm really excited about this is a blank journal. Um, let's see. It's 240 pages. It's got a pocket on the inside, but, um, on the back, it's got like their little, uh, alphabet, but it says excellence is real. Um, I believe this on the front says kill the past. Uh, but I'll have to look at like their little cards to make sure that I'm correct. I almost don't even want to open this. I really don't, but this is cool. Um, and then we've got a pack of trading cards. So the excellence trading cards. Let's see. We're moving them from their pack live on video. So mine may not be worth as much as the next guys, but they're mine. So, ooh, very cool. So we got Spencer. We got his brother, Aaron. We got Monique. We got Darian. Daquan. Raymond, the father. We got Gigi, one of my favorite characters in the book, is Spencer's grandmother. We got Stephanie. Stephanie is Spencer's mother. And then we've got the Hillmen. Very cool. Very cool. So we got a lot of cool uh, stuff here. And it's got like facts about their speed and their rankings, their magic rankings. This is dope. I love these cards. Definitely glad I backed the level to get some cards. And now... um. I guess we'll go ahead and get inside this book because like I said, I think it's supposed to come with a signed art plate. So I'm going to go ahead and use just my hands. All right. So here it is. Excellence, book one, the deluxe edition, super dope, with the red gilded pages, with the nice ribbon. Oh, this is, this is so nicely put together. All right, so let's see what else we got. We've got a poster here. It says excellence is real, with Spencer right here on it. That's awesome. So, okay, okay, cool. So my signed book plate is already in the book. Very cool. So signed here by Brandon Thomas and Kari Randolph, right on the first page. And here's the book. Super dope. It's a signed and sketched edition. I am so, so excited about this book. I guess I should do like some sort of a um, overview. So I guess we'll, we'll do that. 
This collects issues one through nine of excellence, if I'm not mistaken. Man. Yeah, issues one through nine. And this is so dope. So they've got a page here where they are thanking all of the uh, Kickstarter backers. And there's my name right there, BJ Kicks. That is super, super dope. Man, I'm so excited about this. All right, so I'm gonna clean off this desk and uh, we'll get into an overview. But first, I gotta let you know that um, I got something extra here. They gave me two. So, um, stay tuned. So uh, let me clean off this desk and uh, we'll get a little bit of an overview going so you guys can see what I see when I open up this book. All right, you guys. So this is uh, the excellence oversized hardcover. I've got it next to this random Marvel omnibus. Just so that you can see, it is the same size as an omnibus. It is larger than your standard trade paperback or regular hardcover. Um, and now that I've done the size comparison, we can get this out of the way. And uh, let's show you so that you can see what I see. Uh, now, like I said, oh wait, I don't, why, I don't know why I picked this up. This is me, hi. <laughs> but this is Excellence Book One, written by Brandon Thomas, art by Kari Randolph, uh, with colors by Emilio Lopez. This book, I don't know if you can tell, but it's got like this spot it's like raised, it's like embossed. You can see clearly the foil right here, the red foil. There's like a blue hollow foil on Spencer's body. This is just a very beautiful book. Like this was worth every penny that I paid for it. Um, Cause I think in order to get like the signed edition with all the extras, I paid like 140, just under $150 for all this, including shipping and all that. Um, but look, there's your spine image. And then here's the image from the back. Um, and it looks like this might be destined for a release in stores. It does show a retail price of $50 uh, USD. So keep that in mind. It might hit shops. It might not. I don't know. But I mean, it is published by Image Comics and Skybound. So I imagine it would hit the direct market at some point. Look at those beautiful red gilded pages. That was a stretch goal. The campaign reached like a hundred thousand, if I'm not mistaken, and uh, they reached it. So, without further ado, well, first let me kind of stretch this out the right way before I start giving the straight up overview. Let's give that ribbon some work. Man, I am super excited about this. So this series I learned about because of the Kickstarter. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to read the first few issues. So I read volume one in uh, digital. I read it on Comixology and I was like, all right, I've read the first six issues. This series is awesome. Let me go ahead and back the Kickstarter. And um, I told myself I wasn't going to read any more until this book came because the first time I experienced it, I wanted it to be oversized, um, even though I did buy all the single issues. Um, I think issue 12 is is due out soon, uh, next month. Uh, so anyway, here we go. The excellence, like I said, <laughs> created by Brandon Thomas and Kari Randolph. Here is my signed book plate. Um, I like that they put it diagonally, like... For a second, I was kind of like frustrated because I'm like, it should be straight. But then you see this is a diamond right here and you got a diamond here. It works with the scheme. Um, so some information about uh, everybody involved with creating this. We've got a foreword here by Merce. Merce uh, being a rapper from California. What's funny is my first job in the music industry was being an intern for Ninth Wonder, who has done several albums with Merce. So there's a connection that I didn't know I would have with this book. Um, and here we go. Volume one, Kill the Past or book one, Kill the Past. 
I'm excited about this. So this starts off with just some information and we get straight into volume one. Man, this looks so beautiful. Um, oversized, man. So this book is about this kid, Spencer. Spencer is the kid on the cover who looks like Michael B. Jordan, right? He looks like Killmonger with a haircut. This guy right here. And Spencer is a part of an order called the Aegis, which is basically like this order of magical, <laughs> I don't want to say magical Negroes, uh, but like, you know, magicians, right? And it's their job. Well, I won't spoil what their job is and why their society of like magicians exists, but they've got an order. They've got like sacred families. They've got rules and Spencer is not here for these rules. Now, one thing that's like a hallmark of this series is Spencer's relationship with his father. Uh, let's just say they don't always see eye to eye, right? And um, so this story is kind of about Spencer's rebellion, Spencer's anger with his father and how he's resolving that. Oh, how he's resolving that, like what all is going on. And as he's doing so, as he's like rebelling against his father, he's also kind of rebelling against everything he was told about this agency and why this agency exists, like the order that he belongs to. Uh, so it's a very good read. I'm only six issues in. This book collects the first nine issues. Um, they haven't announced officially, but my guess is that this series is going to wrap up with 18 issues. Um, because the first volume, if you're reading this in trades, is Kill the Past. Um, and I can't remember the second volume. It's like Embrace the Present or something like that. And then I would only imagine that the next six issues will be, you know, Hope for the Future or something like that, right? Something with the future. And that should be it, right? It's a short story with a definitive beginning, middle, and end. Um, but yeah, so Spencer is going on this whole like campaign to kind of abolish this society that he was born into. And along the way, we are learning why, how, who's behind all of this. Oh man, there is a bonus story in here. That's cool. I think this bonus story is from the Skybound X um, comic, that anthology that came out a couple months ago. So that's dope. And then here we are with some extras in the back. And I love that they call this the cipher. So we've got the script for issue number one. Wow, is this like the full script? Oh, that's awesome. So we're getting some behind the scenes on how this book came together, like what Brandon Thomas wrote, what Kari added to it. That's awesome. It really is the full script, all 32 pages, all 30 pages of issue one. Turn this light down a little bit. So yeah, um, we've got the original series pitch. That's awesome. Character designs. Man, there are so many extras in this book, by the way. Like, the extras started all the way back here. And we're not done. Look at all those extras. Very, very cool. So we got interviews between the letters. We got a cover gallery. Very awesome. We got all the covers. We got variant covers. Nice. Super dope. And then the special thanks to all the Kickstarter people. And like I said, here's my name right here. I put my whole name. I could have just put BJ Kicks, but I didn't. Oh, cool. Reggie Collects is in here. Let's see if there's anybody else I recognize in here. That's awesome. That 
in itself is awesome. I think you did have to back at a certain level to get your name in the book. So everyone's not listed there, but that's still cool. And then creator bios. I love these bookend pages. I love that this dude looks like uh, Brian Tyree Hill from Atlanta and uh, the Eternals. Um, man, this is just so well done. Look at this. I love this gold ribbon. This book just looks so premium. Like I'm thinking about like all the other image and skybound books that I have. Um, all these hardcovers. I got the Skyward hard, hardcover from image. I got monstrous. I got middle west, east of west. This is definitely the best looking one out of all of them. And I think it's these red pages that really, really set it apart. Um, look, if you're able to get this in a comic shop for $50, like get it, like just get it. It's absolutely worth that price. And I am super, super excited. So shout out to Brandon Thomas, shout out to Kari Randolph and Emilio for creating an amazing product. I'm so glad that I backed this Kickstarter and helped make this book happen. Um, they didn't need my hundred dollars. They far exceeded their goal. But man, I'm so glad I could say I was a part of this and I saw it, you know, before the time ran out. Uh, but that's going to do it for this overview. Hope you saw something you liked in this video. You have not checked out this series. Do it. Get it digitally. Get the singles. Get the trades. I'll leave the links in the description below. But get this book however you can get it. It is that good. Like I said, I hope you saw something you liked. If not, that's cool because you can always buy what you like. Just make sure you read what you buy and be nice to others because kindness makes the world go round. Peace.